Hello. Yeah, hello. Red. Red. Green. I need some green. And blue. That's it. I've done it, guys. I've created a rainbow. Well, not yet. I've created the ingredients and put them in this jar so that I can make a rainbow. Do you guys understand how hard it is to make rainbows? I don't think you do, because you're not scientists. I want to make a rainbow, and to do that, you need science. And lucky for me, I'm a scientist. Wait, it might need more yellow. Now that we've got all of the colors that we need in our rainbow jar, I'm gonna go outside and squirt it into the sky and make a rainbow! Do you guys wanna watch me make a rainbow? I bet you do, because I'm using science! Let's go outside! Ah, what a perfect day! All this day needs is a rainbow! Okay, Sky, here comes your rainbow! Ready? Fire! It didn't work! It didn't work, guys. <laughs> oh, which fall corner did you guys do? Oh, hey, Professor Kawana. I was trying to make a rainbow. I use science in everything. And I put all of my ingredients in a jar, and I went outside, and I squirted it into the sky to make a rainbow, and it didn't work. Oh, no. Well, do you want to try this, maybe? What's that? It's the Project MC Square Ultimate Lab Kit. Wow, the Project MC Square Ultimate Lab Kit? Uh, Professor Kawana, do you think that can help me make a rainbow? It most certainly can. Oh boy, Professor Kawana is going to help us make a rainbow. See, look guys, Project MC Square Ultimate Lab Kit. Look at all the things you could do. You could create a rainbow in a jar. A rainbow in a jar. That's what we want to make. Experiment at home or on the go. It comes with 30 pieces. And look, you can also make slime, glittery slime, and your own bubble blower, and custom dye flowers, and investigate using a microscope. It even comes with a microscope. Are you guys ready to open up the Project NC Square Ultimate Lab Kit? Uh, me too. Uh, are you ready, Professor Kawana? Absolutely. <laughs> Professor Kawana's ready too. Uh, let's do it. Okay, Lab Kit, we have to open you up so that we can make rainbows and slime and stuff. And do experiment. Oh look, it has a zipper. You gotta take off the tape and stuff. But look, it's a zipper. And when you unzip it, wow, it opens up into the cool lab kit. Holy smokes! Look at the inside of this thing. It's pretty big. Now let's get the microscope out so we can observe important science stuff. Oh. Oh. Look, look inside there, guys. Can you see the science? Look, it even comes with little, little science beaker stuff so you can put all your special ingredients in here. Oh, and it even comes with a ring, an MC Square ring. Oh, look at this. Guys, hey, look, there's even more stuff in here. There's all sorts of containers and stuff, science containers. You get a funnel, oh, and you get a big jar. Wow, maybe this is what we could use to put our rainbow in. And see, it has drawers that you can open up and keep all your special science stuff inside. And it's got, oh, look, it even comes with a pair of special safety glasses. So when you're doing your experiments, your eyes can be safe because you gotta be safe when you're doing science. I'm gonna wear these glasses when we make our rainbow. And look, you get instructions and composition book. And the book is all full of super experiments. Look, look, make a rainbow. We found make a rainbow. Professor Kawano, look, it says make a rainbow. We can make a rainbow. Yeah. Oh, and look, it even comes with stickers. It comes with all these cool stickers so you can put stickers on the outside of your box. I like these eyeglass ones because they're like scientist glasses and I'm a scientist. And look, guys, look, I'm even wearing my new glasses that I got with the lab set. And Professor Kawano, this book tells you everything. It tells you how to make a rainbow in a jar. Yes, and as you can see, you need lots of ingredients to make a rainbow in a jar. Is that what all this stuff is, Professor Kawana? Exactly. Well, we should show everybody what this stuff is. Can I tell everybody what you need? Sure. Yeah, I'm gonna show you guys what you need to make a rainbow in a jar. It says you need food coloring, a whole bunch of different colors. Look, we got, we've got green food coloring, and blue food coloring, and red food coloring, and yellow food coloring. That's so many colors of food coloring. And then it says 
You need liquids of different densities, like honey. I've got lots of honey right here. Oh, I love honey. And corn syrup. We've got corn syrup. Mmm, I wonder if you could put that on your waffles. And you need rubbing alcohol. We've got rubbing alcohol with 70% isopropyl. 70% isopropyl. And water, I got lots of that. And dish soap, we got dish soap. Just washing liquid, citrus scent. Perfect for making rainbows. And vegetable oil. Oh look, we got vegetable oil. And that's the last thing you need is a jar. See, jar. And look, we just happen to have a jar right here. Project MC Squared jar. It comes with the project kit. Holy smokes, that's a lot of stuff. Oh, what do we do now, Professor Kiwana? Well, let's take the book. And let's see. All right, first we're gonna start with honey. So take your Project MC Square jar, take the lid off, and we're gonna add a small amount of honey inside of it. I like honey. I do too. Okay, so we're, make sure that the honey fills the entire bottom of Put it. Put more honey in it, Professor Kiwana. Okay. Wow, what do we do next, Professor Kiwana? Well, next we're gonna add food coloring to the honey. Food coloring, Ooh, we're gonna add food coloring to the honey. What color? Green. Green! Okay, so we're gonna take that off and we're gonna add- Green food coloring? Green food coloring. How much? Well, two drops should be good enough. And it's gonna make the bottom green. Green honey. You can also use your dropper to mix it up. Wow, look at that. It looks so green. That is a really nice green color. Next, we're gonna add corn syrup. Corn syrup? I love corn syrup. Okay, so first we're gonna add corn syrup to another Project MC square jar. Oh, that much. Now what do we do? Now we add red food coloring to the corn syrup. Oh, two drops. Then you wanna take your dropper, which also comes with the MC square set, and you wanna mix the corn syrup and the color Ooh, together. It's so red. Look at how red it is. And next we're gonna add this into our rainbow jar. Pour it in. Ooh, red and green. Mm -hmm. And then what's gonna happen is the red corn syrup will separate from the green honey. Wow, so far we've got two colors. We've got green and we've got red. Now what color are you gonna do? Orange. Orange? How are we gonna do orange? With orange dish soap. Oh boy! You don't have to use a separate jar with this because it's already orange. Oh, that makes sense. Oops. Wow, now we've got green, we've got red, and we've got orange. What color should we do next? Well, the next ingredient is gonna be blue water. Blue water, just like the ocean. Here's the water, and here's the blue food coloring. So we're gonna let's go ahead and add a few drops. Blue. Ooh. Holy guacamole! Well, you gotta be kidding me! We've got green, we've got red, we've got orange, and we've got blue! What in the world would we put in there next? Well, next we need to add vegetable oil. Vegetable oil! And just vegetable oil. Because oil and water in the food coloring don't mix. What's next? Well, it's our last step, so we're gonna mix some rubbing alcohol with some yellow food coloring. Okay, so we're gonna use a jar and a funnel to make it easier to pour the alcohol. Now let's add our food coloring. Pick this out. And add a few drops. Add our yellow. Oh, that's good. Okay, so we're gonna pour this into here and we'll have our last color. And that's it, a rainbow in a jar. Good. Professor Kawana, it looks kind of dark. Oh, well, that's because we have to put it in the light. Wow, you're right, Professor Kawana. Look at all the colors in there. Yeah, science is fun. Who knew that rainbows were made up of honey and all sorts of stuff that you could just find in your kitchen? I didn't know that. It's pretty cool though. Anyway guys, thanks for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the video and tell all your friends about the video. Thanks for watching all the videos and check out some of these other cool videos on the channel and we'll see you guys soon. And I love rainbows and I love science and I love you guys and I'll see you next time. Thanks guys, love you guys, bye.